Welcome back to the Front Effect. Welcome. I'm Anina. I'm Avery. Anina has one gray hair. Avery used to have rabies. Okay, that's not true, but. All right, well, you may be wondering why we're so dressed up tonight. We're looking very snazzy, I know. My suit fits better than anything that's ever fit ever. Yes. Don't ever tell me anything different. Well, the reason we're so dressed up is because, you know, you guys asked, we answered, we're delivering. We're the best. We got an exclusive interview. With, with the one and only. President Hefner. Ah, Dr. Hefner, can you come, come out, out here? baby. Oh Hello. Hello. Welcome. Nice to finally meet both of you. You're looking so dapper. Oh, thanks so much. I was so excited to be here today. I love getting to meet the students of the school that I'm now president of. Yes. Oh my God. I'm so excited. Well, welcome. Here. Welcome. Thank you. So that leads us into our first question. How did you get this job? Well, see, the business that I'm in, or <laughs> was in, uh, you can't just leave. You can't leave the industry. No, it's not. It's you're kind of set for life. Well, if you may have noticed, you guys might have thought my life had ended. Yeah. But no, you, you have to fake your death, and then, then you can pursue other dreams. Oh my gosh, you faked your death? Yes, so I could pursue oh. my dream of running a college. Oh my god. Wow, that was, you know, That's so sweet of so you. So brave, so brave. Mm. <laughs> well, I do it for the kids. Thank you for your service. I did a lot, I mean, like, I mean, you guys might think of me as like, sort of like an adult entertainer. I have done a lot for the kids in the past, so. Yeah, uh -huh. you've entertained me quite a bit. Oh, I get that a lot. <laughs> so, next question. Where is your office located? Oh, well, you guys may have been wondering what's been going on with uh, Houghton Hall recently. <laughs> well, that's been in the works for my new Playboy Mansion. Oh, exciting. Mm-hmm, so I've been in there. There's all that, f that construction going on. Mm -hmm. That's just, they're just adding like, you know, statues of me, you know, some bunnies here some and there. Bunnies. Oh, wow. Yeah. So and it's gonna, I'm also renaming it to Hugh Tun Hall because, oh. you know, it's kind of a big like deal. I'm kind of a big deal. Yeah, okay. like my name. I, I get, so yeah. will student, will you invite us, like the students? Oh, it's invite only. You know, I can't just invite is, every student. Is it like, is it like an That's academic an event. building? <laughs> yeah, academic? It, well, you might learn a thing or two, that's for sure. Okay. Yeah. Interesting. Yeah. Okay. Um, next question. Where is Ginny? Oh, Ginny. Well, uh, you know, there uh, comes a time in everyone's life when you have to, uh, you have to settle down. Um, someone a little bit younger, you know. Uh, we're, both, we're both older, but yeah, yeah. she's in good hands. She's in good hands. Good hands. You were old enough to pass away, though. Yes. She's alive. Did you answer the question? Oh yeah, yeah. No, she's with me. You're, are you asking what I did? Oh. Are you asking what I did with her? Yes. Because what? The real question is, what didn't I do to her? Oh, okay. Okay. Um, next. next, we really miss Fred and Donna, the dogs. The dogs. Oh. Do you have any pets? You know, I used to have a goldfish, but she died. Okay. Well, our station knows a little about that. That's all I got to say that. about that one. Okay. Yeah. R.I.P. I mean, I can. I know a thing or two about goldfish as well, so I can help you out with that one hey. if you uh, hey. having problems with your goldfish. Okay. Um, you Barbara's seem, okay. Yeah, she's fine. Hmm. You seem like a pretty snazzy guy. You're pretty well. Oh, well, thank put you together. very much. You seem very snazzy yourself. Thank you. And and same goes for you. Oh, don't tell him that. Just Who gave you those legs? <laughs> well, see, I have my to, mom. I have to wear, pass by wearing pants because I can't, I can't bear to show my legs. <laughs> Good. I'm Unlike glad other you covered things. them up. Thank you. Yeah. So, if you don't mind my asking, what is yeah. your net worth? My net worth? Well, uh, before meeting uh, my now lovely wife. Uh, it was a whopping zero. I've, I've been poor man, but now I could happily say my net worth is a whopping twelve million dollars. Wow. Yeah. Okay, that leads us into our next portion. Mm -hmm. So you guys obviously have a lot of questions. So we brought in a student panel oh. to ask you some questions. I love the students. students you know, have I mentioned how much I've done for the kids? Oh yes, you have. Thank oh you. okay. Yes. Thank I, sometimes you. I forget. You know. Eighteen yes. up, right? <laughs> yes, always. So sure. there's been a lot of changes around campus. Like they've got questions for you. So 
All right. It's their turn to open up. Oh, they're already here. Perfect. They are. How are you doing? Good. Why did you do that to Willie's? Why did I do that to Willie's? Well, uh, it's the honor the whole process of, you know, Willie's is becoming bigger and better. And who, come on, honestly, who doesn't want a bigger Willie? There are rumors that Playboy magazine is buying the leader. Is this true? Oh, we've been in the process. Yeah, we've been buying the leader. We're trying to make it more family friendly. Uh, in terms of Playboy, we want to reach all audiences. We, all, we want to educate about animal knowledge, specifically bunnies. Okay. In the leader. How will that help, like, journalism? Well, you see, the, the more you know paper? about, like, more exposed bunnies, the more you know about journalism. Okay. One plus one equals two. Okay. Uh, there is a vacancy of a strip club downtown uh, now. Do you have any plans to fill this space? What do you think Houghton Hall is going to be? Or Houghton Hall, my bad. Yes. Uh, <laughs> are you interested? Is that, is that why you asked that question? Are you interested? <laughs> are, are you interested? Yes, I'm very interested. What's your interested. first name, son? Uh, uh, Vino. Nino? Vino. Vino. Yeah. All right, you're number one on my invite list to Hewton oh. Hall when it finally opens. Thank you. Have you ever had a lap dance? <laughs> Never. Oh. Just in my dreams. All right. <laughs> I'm with you there. I've been there. I made dreams become a reality. I love working with the kids. <laughs> There's a rumor of a mysterious buyer looking into Sunny's and renaming it Bunnies. Is oh that my you? God. Yes, of course it's me. Like I said, I'm I'm an insane environmentalist. I'm an insane botanist. I love bunnies. For whatever that has to do with it. Do you know about rabbits? I know a thing or two. Yeah, like I said, I had a goldfish. So I know a lot about rabbits as well. Next one. I got a special one. Yeah. What'd you do with the missing twelve million dollars? Well, I uh, can't. Well, I, I can't really t talk about that. Okay. It's like it's, it's like okay. that's enough for that's, today. I think that'll do she it. She had it lying around. <laughs> she didn't that's take enough. anything. We're good. Okay. We're get, you got, just get out of here. Right, just get out. Let's go. Just get out. You know, it didn't and go as planned, and you gotta get. We have extra that's money. That's enough. That's just. All right. <laughs> Bye. Get out. Get out. Get out. I'll be right back. Hi. You think you're probably sober? Yeah. But you're thinking about taking the back roads home, just in case. If you're probably sober, then why would you do that? Good choice. Probably okay isn't okay. If you see a warning sign, stop and call a cab, a car, or a friend. That's a full glass of wine. I'll be chatting you later. I realized that I'm not perfect, but it all really started to change because you judge me for having a problem. No one is going to know that I need help. I need help. I know that no one is going to judge me for having a problem. I realize that I'm not perfect, but it all really started to change because you listen. Oh, look, a redhead. <gasps> Staring contest. You still got it. I know. Come alive with the forest. The dad was cute. You were looking right at us. Visit discovertheforest.org to find a forest near you. There are 16 million children struggling with hunger in America. That's one in five daughters, sons, neighbors, and classmates who don't know where their next meal is coming from. Yet billions of pounds of good food go to waste every year. It's time we do something about it. Feeding America is a nationwide network of food banks that helps provide meals to millions of kids and families in need. Visit feedingamerica.org to help them feed even more. Together, we can solve hunger. Together, we're Feeding America.
So, same time next week? Well, of course. Put away a few bucks, feel like a million bucks. For free tips to help you save, go to Feed the Pig. Hamilton was adopted from a rescue in 2008. He really likes to be around people. And as soon as I start to make my breakfast, Hamilton is right there. I get out my mat, and I'm doing a downward dog, and he's underneath. He's quite the pug about town. He gets invited to a lot of parties. He knows he's a pretty big deal. I mean, look at this little face. How do you not love him? from the creative galaxy in my idea box. Transform your world. Will you help me make art? Each one of our journeys keeps us Before you throw it away. Hey, I have an idea. Think outside the box. We'll never get older. Each one of our journeys keeps us Give your cardboard box another life. Recycle. So, I'm kind of new here, but I've noticed a trend. My human does this funny thing where she goes around and gets all my toys, and then she hides them in that basket by the door. You know, but it's always the same basket, and it's always in the, in the same place. And then she acts so surprised when I find them, but, you know, she's putting them in the same basket. Again. It's like, hello? That's where you put it last time. You were the worst at hide-and-go-seek. And we're clear. Break for commercial. Oh my god, that was horrible. I need a minute. Can you fix the light? And we're clear. Break for commercial. Oh my god, that was horrible. I need a minute. Can you fix the light? Bitch. Just brush it off. It's okay. Don't listen to him. So I don't know what happened. He well, won't wake up. We're live in 30 seconds. I don't, I don't know what to you do. You Help me. Well, Jovina, I don't have time. Go figure it out. Oh, God. We'll be back at 30. I'll be right back. Hi! You think you're probably sober? Yeah. But you're thinking about taking the back roads home, just in case. If you're probably sober, then why would you do that?
Good choice. Probably okay isn't okay. If you see a warning sign, stop and call a cab, a car, or a friend. That's a full glass of wine. I'll be chatting you later. There are 16 million children struggling with hunger in America. That's one in five daughters, sons, neighbors, and classmates who don't know where their next meal is coming from. Yet billions of pounds of good food go to waste every year. It's time we do something about it. Feeding America is a nationwide network of food banks that helps provide meals to millions of kids and families in need. Visit feedingamerica.org to help them feed even more. Together, we can solve hunger. Together, we're Feeding America. Hamilton was adopted from a rescue in 2008. He really likes to be around people. And as soon as I start to make my breakfast, Hamilton is right there. I get out my mat and I'm doing a downward dog and he's underneath. He's quite the pug about town. He gets invited to a lot of parties. He knows he's a pretty big deal. I mean, look at this little face. How do you not love him? from the creative galaxy in my idea box. Transform your